means God has already decided that I'm gonna drown, but I really would rather die on land. A plague upon this howling! They are louder than the weather our office! That means curse the screaming. They are louder than the weather and our workers. On the top mast, the yards, the boat spread, would I flame distinctly the meat and join. And that means on the insert boat jargon here, I'd set things on fire. Look, he's winding up the watch of his wit. By and by it will strike. That means, check it out, he's winding up like a clock to strike the hour. Oh, that you bore the mind that I do. What a sleep were this for your advancement. That means if you were as smart as I was, you'd take this opportunity while they're unconscious. You cram these words into my ears against the stomach of my sense. That means you're shoving words into my ears that I really don't want to hear. Do you love me? That means, do you love me? Fully many a lady I have eyed with vesture, and many a time the harmony of their tongues hath into bondage brought my too diligent ear. That means I have checked out plenty of women, and they've all whispered lots of sweet nothings into my ears. What have we here? A matter of fish. Dead or alive? <coughs> a fish! He smells like a fish! Which means, what have we here? A matter of fish. That are alive. A fish, he smells like a fish. How camest thou to be the siege of this moon calf? Can he vent trinculos? That means, how did you end up at this monster's dung? Can he poop trinculos? Wilt thou troll the cat you taught me but while air? Troll means sing and catch means tune. So because I'm so happy, I asked them to sing me the tune they taught me a little while ago. Will you? As you, from crimes would pardon be, let your indulgences set me free. That means that the time has come now for the audience who has made this play come alive through their imagination. Now that the play is over, they have to let us go. Here's my comfort. <laughs>